Welcome to the party, honey. <laughs> it, it, it's important to talk about the misfits and, and such the such a decorated history that you guys have had in the sort of aim of the genre of horror punk. Um, you know, looking back at that, you guys have obviously been credited as creating the genre. Does it feel that you created a movement in music? We're not just a horror punk band, okay? We might have got stuck in that category because we are probably the best horror punk band. But we're much more than that. We do ballads, we do thrash, we do death metal, we do speed metal, we do it all. Do you feel like you started a movement, though? Sure. I think we changed the planet. <laughs> And they're modest. They're super <laughs> modest, which is good, well, too. Well, <laughs> you know, it, the Ramones came along and changed the face of music and really put everything back to a basic binary code. We came along, and we took it, and we put it in a place where all of a sudden it does, it's a cult following. I think that what we do is kind of very, very timeless. I don't think, I don't think time is going to affect the impact of what we've done. Is it weird for you guys now to see a lot of, you know, pop stars and kids wearing Misfits logos and the Misfits shirt? When you see, like, former Disney actors, like, Miley Cyrus, for instance, she wearing a She was sporting one. She had, I saw her wear a Slayer one, too. You know, now, you know, we sell more girl shirts than we do anything else. So, and, so the audience has And they're real-looking girls. I mean, they're not, you know, these, you know... Ones that could kick my ass. Yeah, yeah. No, you know what was ironic? weird for me? It was one of these big companies was doing a fashion show in Paris. Sure. And the girl came out with a sliced Misfit shirt with a Misfit thing on the bag. And these guys, right now, these guys got tons of money. They don't even, like, call up and say, hey, you know, we want to use this. Or anything. And they start trying to market our stuff. And we're like, what are you people out of your mind? So is it a massive age range at the shows now, then? You were talking yeah. about that. Five years ago, we're at a smaller place than this, and there's a balcony. And I see a little girl. I, I just stop in the middle of the song and go, I said, I got to know, you know, is this your daughter? And the middle, girl in the middle stands up, the woman, and she goes, yes, this is my daughter. She's seven. And my first show was a misfit show my mother brought me to when I was five. So I had three generations of people standing right in front of me. That's awesome. Yeah, and that just told you that, you know, this is not going away. Thank right. you guys so much for hanging out. It's a pleasure. No, no sweat. Thanks for making awesome. us get dressed early. Totally, we owe, dude. We owe Thanks, you guys man. a good beat.